about to say, was this intentional or was this a mess up? It looks like it was a mess up. Way to go, wizard dude. You really botched it. Alright. Hello everyone and welcome to Diablo Hellfire. Uh, the expansion to Diablo, the original Diablo, which features not only two extra levels, but a slew of monsters that were created for the original game but never released, a number of items that were created for also for the game but never released, and in particular added a one official character to the game, which was the monk, but also hidden away in the code with uh, an EC opened up with literally a text file. Big <laughs> large huge is my single player uh, barbarian. There are two other hero classes, the Barbarian and the Bard. I have decided by coin flip before we actually started the main stream here, we're going to use the Bard which borrows lots of uh, visual representations from the uh, Rogue. Originally uh, th uh, they had gotten as far as at least making them useful under the Rogue and the Warrior looking uh, programs inside the game. The match, yeah. But uh, they were intending to make uh, more sprites individual, just like the monk here. But they were told last minute by Blizzard that they don't want them stepping on their toes. And if you're going to make this add-on slash expansion, please don't do it. So get rid of the bard and get rid of the barbarian. We'll allow you to at least add the monk still. So that's why we got the monk that with his own official original art, and then we had the bard and barbarian, which again, you add a text file into the program files of this game and just automatically unlocks them. They have their own abilities too. Uh, the barbarian has a rage. I'm not sure what the rage does, but the bard we're going to pick here is literally the most middle of the road character. I think she doesn't have any stats that go up to 200, like the bar like the barbarian has a two over 200, a uh, 200 or more. Uh, maximum of both strength and vitality, more than even the warrior from the original. But she has a 150, uh, I believe, setup which she can achieve if you just want to keep pumping all the stats up. Which means she's actually pretty decent at almost everything. And look, uh, yeah, look at her stats. Let's look at the rogue 20, 15, 30, 20. 20, 20, 20, 25, 20. The bard is literally just waiting here for you to go. Okay, we're gonna just uh, boost all these stats evenly now. Uh... Oh gosh, I never actually thought about a nickname for the character first. Um... I could go with one of my usual ones, but... I'm trying to kind of avoid that. I'm trying to be a little more creative with my character names. I think I got an idea. Uh. I. I guess that's fine. I don't know. I'm trying to think. I'm double guessing myself now. I always hate it when I get to part of the character creation, and then it's like a name. Oh shit, a name. Um. Sure. That should be fine. Um. I'm trying to. I'm thinking right here right now, I don't know why you can only select the difficulty right now when you're creating a character. You would think you'd be able to add a uh, Nightmare or Hell later on, but oh well, we'll do it with normal for now just to make sure that this is playable. And yes, in town, fast speed. Ludicrous speed. Whee! Time to follow Duncan Geese? Not special, tell me about. Hello, my friend. Not Stay special. a while and listen. Well, what can I do for you? Unsocial. By the way, we should double check. Oh, she's dual wielding. Okay. I forgot that was a thing too. They actually added dual wielding, so you can have two one-handed swords, two one two one-handed weapons in the game. What ails you, my friend? Thank you, I got no money right now. Thank goodness you've returned. Much has changed since you lived here, my friend. All was peaceful until the Dark Riders came and destroyed our village. Many were cut down where they stood, and those who took up arms were slain or, or dragged away to become slaves. 
or worse. The church at the edge of town has been desecrated and is being used for dark rituals. The screams that echo in the night are inhuman, but some of our townsfolk may yet survive. Follow the path that lies between my tavern and the blacksmith's shop to find the church and save who you can. Perhaps I can tell you more if we speak again. Good luck. All right. Nothing else right now. Uh, we, if we do bump into Leoric, we won't know about it until we get close to the third floor. Why do I suddenly sound so quiet? It's, maybe it's because of the distance of the microphone. Okay, yeah, I think I backed up the microphone a little bit. All right. Here we go. Butcher? Yep, Butcher. Please, listen to me. The Archbishop Lazarus. He led us down here to find the Lost Prince. The bastard led us into a trap. Now everyone is dead. Killed by a demon he called the Butcher. Avengers! Find this Butcher and slay him. So that our souls may finally rest. Your death will be avenged. The sanctity of this place has been fouled. Although I will say I'm disappointed that the animations don't show that you have two hand two one-handed weapons, which is why I think I'm gonna change back to a sword and board anyway. Wow. Just getting seized upon already, okay. Oh. Found a magic small axe, we're not gonna be bothering with any axes either. I should explain what I just did there. Actually, I'm surprised it went off like it did. I thought I had more of them. I guess I must have only had the one. Uh, that was a uh, rune of fire, and they require zero magic ability to set, and essentially what they are is a fire trap. So, actually, come to think of it, even though this isn't a Blizzard game, or not a Blizzard made expansion, that was apparently an idea that they might have had for the game that they never finished. But Sierra finished for them for the Hellfire. And it's essentially like a fire trap. But it's a one time use fire trap. But usually you can find them in multiples and they'll and you can spread them around a little bit. My character's ass is getting kicked. She really does need a shield. Alright. She needs a shield, but also uh, I think we've got enough cash we can at least get the axe identified and for the shield. Yep. And we got an extra short sword, which is also magical. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely time to identify stuff. Please give me a good axe. That's all I need is I need some money right now. Hello, my friend. Stay a while and listen. Axe of Decay, plus 213% uh, damage. Whoa, what can Game's I do weird. for you? I'm, never, I'm not sure how that really works. But hey, we made some of our money back. So tell me about the Hello, sword. Hello, my friend. Stay a while and listen. Occasional triple damage. Nice. Okay. Whoa, what can I do for you? Got any shields I can afford? Nah, looks like none of the magical stuff I can afford right now. 
shield of health would be nice when I can afford it. Actually, no, that's not even back of a shield. Um, buckler. Yeah, buckler is looking like it's gonna be our best bet right now. We can't equip that, which requires 25 strength. Although we could pretty soon, but not at the moment. So buckler it is. Buckler it is. I listen to my voice for no reason. What ails you, my friend? What ails you, my friend? All right. Got a shield now. Hopefully we won't get hit by everything, although I will say when I tried the Barbarian with the Buckler, he was getting all kinds of smacked about. It's when I finally got a small shield that he started blocking just about everything. I will say I also uh, saw some stats on like animations and stuff. I come to the realization that um, Outside of magic, the rogues actually have the fastest uh, attack animation. <coughs> Excuse me, which actually makes them the best uh, combatants for everything except for magic. With magic, they're just as slow as a warrior, and mages are the ones that get the uh, hyper speed magic spell casting. Pick up whatever that was. Okay. That's a magic falchion. That's cool. We might want to keep it when we finally identify it. Not doing too bad at the moment. Let's check this way. I'm about to say let's open this door, but no. Let's check this way. There's technically... Another open doorway already right here. Nothing over here. Big room. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> Come on, can scavenger. Well, she's doing a better job blocking so far than the barbarian did. Maybe it's something to do with her dexterity. I don't think that the uh, barbarian's dexterity was very good. It's better than its mana, which is zero. The Barbarian can get zero magic unless you get a plus all attributes item. Rune of Fire! Fire. I see it burn. That small shield now. What does this need? Oh wow. Yet another five strength. It's gonna be a few levels before we get there, but okay. I plan to equalize out her stats and then uh, keep her equalized the rest of the game. She's the middle of the road character, and I'm gonna do my best to keep her as good as she can be at the middle of the road. Maybe she'll have more magic ability than our warrior did. Hoping that the other little bloody imps would have gotten smacked with that fireball too, but apparently not. Such is not my lot. Oh, 
Oi. You stop running from me. Right now I'm picking up all the gear because all of the gear is money right now. Wow, you're a pain in the neck. Seems like every once in a while that uh, triple damage is kicking in. And it did say once in a while. Oof. Oh, I forgot to mention, her uh, special skill is that she can identify anything. So we actually don't need identify skills anymore. I just haven't realized we didn't need to spend that money on cane. Dang it. Well, let's use up the scroll. Chance to hit plus 5% and adds 1 point to damage. Oh man, that's so nice. I wish we could use it right now. Nothing else needs identifying? Nope, not at the moment. Okay. Actually, yeah, we should be saving the game. We haven't saved yet. You. Where are you? Don't see me anywhere. Oh, there's a job. Uh, here's a couple zombies. Take the magic cape. You can fall over, please. Nice. Fine cape, plus 27% armor. Nine! Nine! <laughs> Stat. All right. I actually didn't realize this is an open thing over here. Apparently, surprised I didn't get jumped by monsters. Hand back this way while I keep an eye on the map. I'm trying to see if there's any more stuff we missed. Actually, I think there's another door over this way. And I think we've covered just about everything in the main room stuff now. So, we should be able to head back, take care of stuff in town again, and get the cape patched up. If we can't uh, sell it for something slightly better. We can come.
come back down and uh, actually go through that door over there on the map. Wee! It is so much handier to be moving faster in town. Let me see here. Um... Wow! What can I do for you? Staff of Holy Boat, we're gonna send to the witch, so don't bother that. Patch up the sword I'm gonna keep. Aw, oh, man. Okay, let's go sell the staff. Oh, yeah, I found this too, by the way. I think this is probably an entrance way to one of the new floors. Which means I won't be surprised if I find a couple others as we go around. I sense a soul in search of answers. There we go. Now we don't need any potions from you, but I will check and see if you got any shields. Or not shields, books. Book of lightning, wow. That's early and yeah, it's way too expensive, so never mind. Thanks anyways. Yoink! Gonna head over this way. Now we're gonna pick up some more potions. What ails you, my friend? What ails yeah. you, my friend? I'm so used to the old setup. Whoa! What can I do for you? I don't think I can afford any premium. Club of Decay. Small shield. Wow, what can I do for you? Thank you, bye bye. Play the song the hedgehog music, you know the one. To peek over here. Seems to be a little room all alive. It's lonesome. Hey there, guys. Well, I got hit, but I think I took a lot less, da a lot less damage. <laughs> Occasionally I can speak uh, English forward and fluently, despite being born in America all my life. Hi, says Americans too! Hello! I can hold the English. All the identify scrolls while well, I'm playing a character with an identify skill. See how long that lasts. Ah. 
Wow. Those actually might be items I want to hold on to, depending. I'm going to see if it lasts uh, a fair amount of time, or if it actually legit will last until we remove the weapon, maybe. for me a little pains. Wow. Let's see, I'm thinking that that's getting pretty close to full of my inventory. Yes it is. I wish I could tilt stuff sideways and things. Yeah, we're gonna have to just leave it. We're wasting time. I like it better in the uh, Elder Scrolls games where you can just have the item on the mouse and just keep walking around while you dangle this item all over the place. Wow, what can I do for you? I sense a soul in search of answers. Four hundred gold. Let's get some real armor. Wow, well, what can I do for you? 400 gold. I don't think I can buy us anything that good in here, but we can have a look. Hmm. I still don't get what the K does. I don't know if it actually helps. Seems to act like it helps, but I don't know. Quilted armor.
Yep. Well, what can I do for you? All right, bye bye. asking you to do please keep going I've just seen a weird highlight on the door. I thought I saw something else for a moment. Nope. Alright. Wraps up this area of the floor. is the northern and the northeastern corners left. So I'm pretty sure we've seen at least most of the northwestern corner. something. Yeah, I haven't checked lately. It's still going. I'm kind of beginning to wonder. That might be a permanent increase. I'm not sure yet. I'm not bought and sold on it. Actually, if uh, if our, any of our usual BitChute commenters could tell me about that, that'd be nice. I don't know if it's a permanent thing or not, but if it is, let me know, and we'll probably hold on to those for a bit. Yeah, that seems to be it. Yeah. All right. Lore 2. Right now, game? Ouch. Yeah! <laughs> 
Weird shrine. What's the weird shrine again? Tabbing out for a moment. Uh, I'll still checking what time we got going here. Yeah, we still got a little while yet. Don't want to hear any of the weird shrines. Don't really mess me up. <clears throat> We are trying. That's plus one to all weapons, max damage until the next game. Next new game, rather. Alright. That took care of a bunch of ya. That was weird. Wow. Last one to old weapons until we new game. Alright. I believe there's no other doors up there, right? Right. There's the stairs going down, but we don't need to... If you race into the bomb floor, thank you. Holy cow. We need to immediately leave the uh, proceedings here. We immediately need to head back upstairs, get ourselves patched up, and get some gear. Woof the. Having this game is actually not as good as original Diablo. I could have been able to click on the stairs in regular Diablo and she would have walked there. It's a little bit strange. What ails you, my friend? What can I do for you? A little bit surprised we haven't found any uh, any libraries yet. I mean, we found the room of skeleton tomes, but we've had zero luck so far of actually finding books. Like hand magic import. All right. All right, punk. Time to uh, give you all the business in my sword. Yeah, you come back. Here. 
Oh look, we found the butcher's room. Definitely not ready. I can barely handle these guys. I'm definitely not ready for the butcher yet. Zombie of Doom. If I couldn't hit him well, I have zero chances of handling the butcher at the moment. Oh, hey. Use that. So I'm beginning to think those last forever. But again, still let me know just in case. <clears throat> Assume it's either permanently or permanently until we do a new game. One of the two. Let's not open any doors yet. I'm just doing cleanup right now. Speaking of some cleanup, I believe we have some zombies over here sitting around in a doorway. Yep.
Nice. Oh, scroll search. Cool. That's the uh, ability that the monk comes with. And it is actually a spell in the game. Um... Mysterious Shrine and Gloomy Shrine. Mysterious. Five points to random attribute and negative uh, one point to one attribute. Oh, no, negative one to the other three attributes and a plus five to one attribute. Gotcha. Um... What's a gloomy? Plus two AC to equipped shield, helm, and armor until next game created. And they're going to want to equip weapons max damage. Uh, equipped weapon to equip and uh, plus AC to the other equipment. Okay. Oh wait, that was the wrong one. That was the stats one, oh well. So I took a negative one from my strength and put a plus five to my dex, gotcha. Right out loud. All right. Bow just break. No. What the hell? She did, like just randomly dropped the bow. I don't know why she, why or how she did that. I can't carry any more. Identify anything, do we? Yeah, I took care of all that downstairs. Uh, um, um. Whoa! What can I do for you? Um. Sell the robe. Keep the small shield. Get rid of the axe. Sword is not as good as the bronze sword of quality. Sorry, sword of devastation. Bye bye. We'll replace you as soon as we possibly can. By premium. Strong cable light plus 40% armor plus 20 light radius. Meh. Nope. Skull cap. Ooh. What are we buying that? Actually, yeah, we're gonna have to hold on to that. When we do new game, then the cap will uh, be back to down to just two AC. For now, 
This is our best stuff. What's this a scroll of? Scroll search, okay. I'll keep that for now. Yeah, don't need anything from Pippin. Hello, my friend. Stay a while and listen. Still checking. What ails you, my friend? See if any of them have got more missions. The village needs your help, good master. Some months ago, King Leoric's son, Prince Albert, was kidnapped. The king went into a rage and scoured the village for his missing child. With each passing day, Leoric seemed to slip deeper into madness. He sought to blame innocent townsfolk for the boy's disappearance and had them brutally executed. Less than half of us survived his insanity. The king's knights and priests tried to placate him, but he turned against them and, sadly, they were forced to kill him. With his dying breath, the king called down a terrible curse upon his former followers. He vowed that they would serve him in darkness forever. This is where things take an even darker twist than I thought possible. Our former king has risen from his eternal sleep and now commands a legion of undead minions within the labyrinth. His body was buried in a tomb three levels beneath the cathedral. Please, good master, put his soul at ease by destroying his now cursed form. All right. Sell the staff. I sense a soul in search of answers. On the safe side. Still not going to do that right now. Not if you and I had all the fire runes that we've seen so far. How would I be trying to stick my neck in there? Yeah. 
character really doesn't matter as much as armor does to me. I'll be more likely to patch up a piece of armor more frequently and only worry about that than I would be worried uh, when I sit around and worry about how much armor I've got and, and find myself lacking because I picked something with higher durability. Almost there. I have no room. All right, we need to go back up. Uh... Wow, what can I do for you? For now, we'll leave this up here. you, my friend. I sense a soul in search of answers. Book of Ring of Fire. Go down, down, down. Nah, I think we're good right now. Just the melee gear one, and I'm ready to finally equip it again. Mm. I don't know why I keep wanting to do that in town. It's not like it would help me anyway. Um. That's just our habit. Just want to open the map. <laughs> Apparently, I shot a zombie.
could use that in the last scroll. Oh well. I have no room. I don't even have room for a healing scroll right now. Okay. for you. can stay there and that thins out my collection currently all right I want to try and get one more level before we end the game tonight uh, black smith oil I believe that's the one yeah, that, require, that recovers durability on weapons and, uh, I believe, also armor. If I recall... Basically gave us two extra points, but did so by directly putting everything into dexterity, and then uh, putting that into dexterity, and then eliminating one point from other stats and boosting the dexterity with those extra points. There we go. We have the sword and shield back. We can now handle melee combat again. That's why I wanted to get back before we left things. So with that being done, I'm going to say we're going to quit here. Uh, and get us into position to where we continue things next time. Which, yeah, it looks like we got this door here yet to cover. So I will see you all again tomorrow. Not tomorrow. Tomorrow we're going to do Kunan Exile stuff because uh, we are going to be missing Barry and we don't want to continue uh, Borderlands without him. So tomorrow will be Conan Exiles. And then Monday I'll be back for some more Diablo Hellfire. So if you want to join me for some more Diablo Hellfire, come through then. Otherwise, I await your comments on the uh, VODs. Which, by the way, don't if you haven't done so yet, do subscribe or follow the on where you're watching. And I will see you all again next time. Have a good night and see you all later.